Hello everyone, this is Jason from Primetime Aquatics, and if you've got aquariums, chances are you've tried to scrape algae off of glass, and if you're anything like us, you've probably tried more than one style, more than one brand, and in our experience, most of them are garbage. They just don't work long term, and we've tried them all. Some examples, we've got this one right here with a fake little blade on the end. It's all bent, it's nasty, it didn't work. This is the one, it's now since been broken, but it's got the adjustable handle and you can put different adjustments on here. For the most part, garbage. We've tried these where it has the softer end and if your algae is very, very soft on the glass, maybe this will work. Or if you've got a biofilm, this tends to work out okay. Obviously this one's been used quite a bit, but even when it was new, it didn't work all that well. And so then we tried the magnetic scrapers. And they were okay, but the problem was, one, you had to make sure that the, the magnet was appropriate for the size tank. It wasn't too big, it wasn't too small, that's fine. Here, there used to be a, a soft felt sort of finish to this so that it didn't scrape the outside of your tank. That has long since fallen off, as they often do with these. And when they do fall off, they'll streak glue all over your glass. These things don't work. At least they haven't for us. I have a much better solution for you. What is that better solution? It's this thing. This I found on Amazon and it has really been a lifesaver for us when we're scraping glass. This thing is a 12 inch extender for an actual real razor blade. Now, obviously the downside of this, razor blades are sharp. So, but this is a 12 inch extender. It is made by Fascio. For 17 bucks, I got this 12 inch extender 10 real razor blades and 10 double-sided plastic razor blades. Affiliate link will be down in the description below. Trust me, this is by far the most effective thing I have ever used at scraping glass. There really isn't any way around a razor blade. Yes, you have to be very careful. You don't want to have a safety issue here. Two, you want to be careful with your glass, making sure that you don't put any scratches in it. And three, yeah, maybe this is not the best thing to use on acrylic. However, for scraping algae in our fish room, there absolutely is no substitute. I don't think I would get around ever using this again or away from using this again. Again, this is a 12 inch extension. So if you've got taller tanks and short arms, maybe this isn't gonna work well for you. But for the vast majority of tanks, in fact, we've got all the way up to 150 gallon tanks here, works just fine. Again, 17 bucks, you get the extender, you get 10 razor blades, 10 plastic razor blades as well. Really can't go wrong. Let me show you how it works. All right, so this is actually the side of our 40 gallon breeder. And we're gonna go ahead and take this razor blade, scrape away. This is the really hard green algae, that spotty green algae that you'll see on tanks sometimes. And it can be very difficult to remove with the standard razor blade. This one, as you can see, it's taking it right off. Almost no effort at all. This is why I keep saying this has been a real time saver for us. Doesn't matter what type of algae it is, it comes off really, really, really quickly. So there you have it. This thing has saved us all kinds of time. Highly recommend if you've got tanks and you've got algae on the glass and you are sick of using all of those aquarium algae scrapers that just aren't working, try this one out. You'll probably have better luck. Appreciate you being here. Again, the affiliate link is down in the description below. We'll see you in the next one.